Delighted to have you with us. Let's hope we have half as exciting a game as we had in the first half of our doubleheader in Pittsburgh. Here's Gustav Forsling out on defense to start, and now he'll head off. Vladimir Tarasenko sends it in. Strange bounce off the back left. Right out in front, and they score. What a break for Florida. Matthew Kachuk, 37 seconds in. It took a very strange bounce off the back out in front of the net, and Kachuk makes it 1 0 for the Cavs. The Bruins start heading around the boards. This puck is supposed to go around the boards, but you hear that sound. That hit one of the partitions, the stanchion behind the net. And Kachuk, who was sitting beside me three seconds earlier, jumps off the bench, skates right down the slot, and beats Olmark. And it's a down from the 40 of a year ago, but he's come on over the second half. Here's Charlie Coyle now for Boston. Cross ice, Andrew Pink put it right on Bob Brosky. Rebound free. Still loose. Tried to get it to the line. It was stopped by Forsling. Bob Rusty left it for Forsling. Tarasenko got knocked down by Lindholm. Now Danton Heinen, and Charlie McAvoy scores! Charlie McAvoy snuck in from the blue line. And the defenseman has Boston on the board. It's one to one. Boy to shoot the puck a little more. He's the beneficiary of a great pinch by Hampus Lindholm. Lindholm closed down straight back on Tarasenko. He's not able to move the puck. But that play starts back with the defenseman. Forsling has the puck and he skates towards Tarasenko. He that takes time. As he does that, he takes away all of Tarasenko's time. Montour set it down low, it carried into the slot, played ahead but not out by Peek, stopped to the line by Cousins. Numbers for Boston across the line. Here's Marshan for Kiki, and a kick save made by Bobrovsky. It's kept in by Brandon Carlo. Walker save, penalty coming up against Florida. Nicola for interference, Boston on the power play. Florida, very good penalty killing team, 82.6%. There's another strange bounce. It came right to Pasternak and a left pass save made by Bobrovsky. Marshan handed it off to McAvoy. The power play is brought to you by Cole. Charlie Coyle behind the net. Pasternak. Marshan one time blocker save again by Bobrovsky. Sam Reinhardt tied for the league lead with five shorthanded goals. And he couldn't handle it at the blue line. Now he does down low. And a stop made by Omar. Look at this Bruins change. They're so slow coming off the bench. They're disorganized. There's only four of them on the ice. And as a result, Lundell goes right down the gut and forces Olmark into a shorthanded stop. The breakaway chance and a blocker save, but a terrible. Van Riemsdyk for the Bruss. Van Riemsdyk. Back to Danton Heinen. 13 on the power play. Nine minutes in the period. Van Riem's like, oh, he puck. Try to set up Heinen for a tap in. Forsling got in the way. Lindholm now. Badgered by Lundell. Threw it on net. Off the chest and into the glove of Bob Rowski in the opening period. Cousins for Bennett with the Chuck on his right. The Chuck down low and it's blocked by Omar. And Fredericks back on it. Trent Frederick grew up in St. Louis. Here's Geeky. And it's squeezed by Bobrovsky with 35 seconds. And we're down to 423 to go in the period. Here's Beecher. Forced around the net by Josh Mahura. Centering pass off the skate of Danton Heinen. And it's sent back by Carlo and played back by Mikola to Losterinen. Takes a couple of whacks from the stick of the brus. 2.40 to go in the period. Off the wall. Rundell. In the right place. Yes, for Boquist back to the line. Grizzly sent it toward the head of free pot. Boquist was being tied up. Crowd wanted a holding call. Boquist, the shot. It's behind Bobrovsky. Still free in the crease. Still free. And the Florida Panthers. James Van Riemsdyk's going to get the tip here on the Boquist shot. It changes direction enough to go through his legs, and then it's mayhem in the crease. There's the tip by Van Riemsdyk. It hits the back left heel of Bobrovsky. Now, when he dives back, 
His big worry is not to knock it in his own net. Here's some skating room for Pasternak. One on one on Ekman Larson. Dips they do and a shot right on. Wow, well, is he fun to watch? Great, crazy, agile play for a scoring chance. And here he turns around Oliver Ekman Larson and gets another chance. Bobrovsky right on it. Along with Marchand are still out there. So it's a partial change as Coils come on with Geeky. Marchand, some room. Down low, they score! Charlie Coyle, the tip in! A power play goal and a 2-1 to Boston lead! He's responded beautifully with a terrific year. The entry in the zone is the key. The Bruins on this power play look far more organized, far more direct. Marshan and Pasternak have done this for years, where Pasternak comes into the zone, finds Marshan wide, and this is a great pass. Beyond the stick of Mikola. Hands it over to Bennett. Great pressure here by the Cats, trying to get the equalizer. And it's free at the top of the crease. It's shoveled through some traffic by Barkov. And now Forsling circles, tried to get a shooting lane, but Zaka was in the way. Reinhardt, his shot, rebound, goal! Sasha Barkov ties it for Florida with 14.36 to go. The Bruins get running around in their defensive zone. Barkov gets loose on the back door. Look at Barkov is going to go from the corner, and then he comes loose. The Bruins are up too high, so Pete goes out to block the shot. Watherspoon's got to deal with Ekman Larson. They need help from the forwards. Nobody picks up Barkov. You're going to watch Barkov wander into position here. And as the defensemen are occupied, both Pasternak and Zaka are two feet apart. Leading to a chance for Lundell. Drops it off and a beautiful glove save. Latest Omar. Keeps it tied at two. Strength of the Bruins is this goaltending duel that backstops everything they do. A three on two when that puck spins over Greslick's stick. Lundell lays it dead center for Rodriguez. And there's Olmark out on top of the paint. A six foot five. After 12 games in a row without a point. Under a minute to go now in regulation. Overtime has not been good to Boston. Marshan trying to avoid that. Free puck for Geeky. He receives this puck in the slot. A turnover by Ekman Larson. Marchand goes to the back end. And he's not able to elevate this up over the left pad of Bobrovsky, who spreads all the way out as far as he can. Oh, and then it's Forsling makes a glove stop on Geeky on the rebound. This puck will... Is off Allmark in just wide. Great move. Strong move for that. By Tarasenko, now a takeaway by Lundell. And a beautiful left skate save made by Olmark. Here's a takeaway by Boquist. Boquist scores! Jasper Boquist wins it in overtime for Boston. Boquist is going to poke this puck away from Ekman Larson. Barkov's not going to be able to catch him. And this is a perfect shot by Boquist. He'd been recalled three times this year. Sent down a couple times, still establishing himself in the middle of that.